In this video, I'll show you how to add a credit card fee to your customer's orders in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Okay, so here we are on our demo site and currently I've set up a rule that says whenever a customer chooses to check out using the credit card or debit card payment, then we want to charge an extra processing fee of 10% to the order value, okay? So for example, if I go ahead and click credit card payment here, here you can see there's a credit card fee being applied and the amount is $50.70. Of course, you can adjust the percentage instead of charging a percent um, of the order total you can just charge a fixed amount as well per item as well okay we can also customize the checkout fee label okay so if you want to create a similar setup on your woocommerce store the first step is to head over to aovup.com go ahead and download the aovup dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin i'll leave a link in the description below and with that being said let's head over to our dashboard Assuming you've downloaded the AOV up a dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin, the next step is to go ahead and upload that plugin. So we'll go plugins, add new, go ahead and upload and install the plugin. Once you've done so, you'll see this Wii Suite menu here. It might say AOV up in the future. Go ahead and activate your license key. Once you've entered it, it will automatically redirect you to this add on section. Okay, and then from here, we'll just go ahead and enable this option where it says dynamic pricing and discount rules. Okay, so now we'll just click manage because we want to go ahead and create our rule. So whenever a customer is paying with a credit card, we want to charge an extra fee on top of that, okay? So here we'll navigate over to checkout fees and then we'll go ahead and click add a pricing group. Okay, so for the title, this is just for internal purposes. However, where it says a checkout fee label, this is what the customer will see on the front end, okay? So we can leave this as it is. Okay, and then here we've got a few options. So we can charge a fee based on a cart total or based on the number of items the customer's got in their basket, okay? So for example, let's say if they've got five items in their cart and then maybe you wanna charge a fixed amount okay per item and you can do so but i'm just going to select um, cart total here and then we'll just charge a percentage based on a cart total so just to keep the math simple we'll say 10 percent okay so we can trigger this condition whenever the customer's paying with the credit card payment okay so i'm just going to select credit card simulation here and then we'll just go ahead and hit save changes Okay, so that's saved, fine. So we'll navigate over to our checkout and then we'll go ahead and test our rule, okay? So let's just quickly refresh this page. Okay, so here you can see our order total and currently I'm paying with a direct bank transfer so there's no credit card fee being applied. However, when I select credit and debit card here, we should be able to see that custom fee, okay? And here we can see the custom fee and um, it was set to 10%, right? So the fee is $50.70, okay? So that's working exactly how it should. And that's a quick and simple way to add a credit card fee to your WooCommerce store. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave it in the comment box below or reach out to support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.